So, here I am in the UK and welcome back to traffic. Uh, so I've just stopped at a services and the motorway was stood still when I pulled off at the services, which was 20 minutes since, and it's still stood up still now. So uh, yeah, I'd kind of forgot what traffic in the UK was like. So I'm just gonna be going onto the motorway in a minute, so I'm going to not video for very long. I'm in a hire car, which is not wanting to cooperate with anything. Um, it's a Toyota Corolla, and it doesn't seem to want to connect the phone or out. So we've got my phone up running the sat-nav, uh, which is always good because I've got no network coverage. So uh, I keep having to try and hop on Wi-Fi where I can, but then that doesn't work. So it's a really successful trip so far. Uh, I was supposed to be arriving in Exeter uh, in about 10 minutes time. And so far, I'm actually not that much further from Gatwick than I started because my flight was delayed and then it took a long time to get the hire car. So yeah, um, success so far is slim. We'll see where we go from there. See you in a bit. Morning. So it is fairly early on Saturday morning and I'm just going for a walk down by a deer park because we don't have deer on the Isle of Man. Now, when I was growing up, I've seen a lot of them because I did grow up in England, but we don't have any on the Isle of Man. I've just walked past a lovely little field, fallow deer, just over there. But I'm now gonna just follow the trail around and see where it goes. So the place that I'm staying has got a, um, a big formal garden as well. So I'm gonna have a look around there. And it's also got a walled garden, which is where they'll be growing vegetables. So definitely worth a look down there. Um, so yeah. I'll let you know what it's like and uh, we'll we'll go with that. Um, yesterday, weather wise and traffic was a bit horrendous. It took me seven and a half hours to drive from London Gatwick Airport down to um, Devon, um, which uh, was supposed to be a three and a half hour journey. Um, so something was definitely not kind of working right there with the timing, but I'm here. Um, and I drove past Stonehenge. Hey, that's cool. Gonna try and have a look in there on the way back. Um, if time-wise allows and there's enough parking. So yeah, we'll, we'll give it a go. And if I see anything else, I'll let you know. So there's some deer just up in this field there. Which is about the terrible photography. Not really set up for it. <clears throat> there is also loads of squirrels around, which again is something we don't have on the island. I do, just down in Devon, just on my way back now, and uh, just literally down the road from where I was, I've stumbled across a heritage railway, so that railway which you saw earlier running along the side of the River Dart, they do have steam trains running on it, uh, we heard them all yesterday, but I've just come past the station, and there's a lovely diesel engine down there, the steam trains are off in the background, but, uh, absolutely stunning. Thankfully, I've got a bit of time on the way back, so I'm just going to have a look here. Uh, there's an otter sanctuary just around the corner, and uh, I was going to go to Stonehenge, but it's very expensive to get in, so I think I'll just take it with a driving past. Um, so yeah, we'll, we'll see where we end up, but nah, this is fantastic. We don't get out this big on the island. We've got steam trains, we've got working steam trains, but not anything this big. This is brilliant. Time to get off now. I didn't end up uh, landing on an aircraft carrier, don't worry. This was the RAF Fleet Arm Museum on the way back. And uh, yeah, had a fantastic time. The Otter Sanctuary ended up being closed, so I didn't get to go there. But all in all, fantastic trip. If you end up down in Devon, definitely recommend having a look around these places. Take care.